everyone, welcome to What's Cooking. Today I have a special guest. He's talented, he is wise, he loves the Lord, he is funny. I am all that. <laughs> Pastor Thank Rafael. You. Thank you. And Thank it's such you. a pleasure to have you today. It's a pleasure to be here. We've been uh, having fun together, you know. Yes. And, and uh, uh, we're here again for another one, another episode of this uh, What's Cooking. Yes. And today, right now, we're going to do a feta cheese salad. And it's really my, my specialty. I made it up. So I'm going to call it Rafael. <laughs> Rafael, you're going to taste good. It tastes good. And we're going to make noise when we eat Rafael Amen. today. Yeah, we're going to, mmm, yummy, yes. that tastes good. Because that's the way to do it. That's right, yeah. Pastor you know? Rafael and I, we like to make noise when we eat. We like to yeah. say. People work hard and make good food and people come and it's so boring. <laughs> So like seriously bad. Oh, I, I, I love this person. I love this person. Some people look are at that. So we got a big dead. tub of um, feta, feta cheese, feta cheese yeah. and we will uh, chop it a little bit more as we go over those big pieces and because they should be like this. Okay. But it's okay. Yeah. All is well. You know what I like about you? The old fashioned way. <laughs> exactly. Isn't it? The way he prepare things. And it's just so easy, simple. You don't, you don't need too many things. No, just no, no. simple. And the way he chopped his garlic. Oh, wow, well, you need to watch the show. Yes. And the way he chopped that garlic, i never seen it in my life. <laughs> you are anointed. You're talented, aren't you? Oh, my you? goodness. This, my sister is so good for my ego. <laughs> Whenever I feel down, I'm going to have to come down and do another show. Actually, it's so, it's so biblical yeah. to have people, you know, in the Bible, uh, with, without Barnabas, they should have would have never had Paul. Yes. The apostle Paul, everybody knows about him. Very few know Barnabas, but Barnabas is the son of encouragement. You know, everybody needs an encourager, yes. and this is my encourager today. <laughs> so you need to get yourself someone. You know what happened when uh, when Mary, yeah. uh, the, the you know the Virgin Mary, when she received the message from the angel and she went to visit her cousin Elizabeth. Yeah. The Bible says when Mary walked in, Elizabeth, Elizabeth was pregnant already, the baby in Elizabeth's womb leaped. Yes. And you know why leaped? Because Mary carrying Jesus. Yeah. And the presence of Jesus is joy. Yes. And the, and the, and the, the young John the Baptist right there, there's two things we learned there, that fetus, you know, do leap. They're alive. Yes. You, you kill him, you kill, you kill a human being. Yes. That's number one. Number two, this, this John, he was so charismatic, you know. He was so uh, full of the Holy Spirit already in his mother's womb. He leaped. So Jesus had a leaper. Well, you should get yourself some leapers. They leap in your yeah. presence. So like when, when my sister comes to my church every once in a while, I leap. I really do. Yeah. I leap with joy because you are such a yeah. Yeah. wonderful... Yeah, we need to put each other, elevate each other exactly. in God's way because there's so many things in our lives these days, right? Amen. That put us down. Beautiful, you know, cheese from Cyprus. Oh, it's Cyprus. The best, the best really feta cheese is the from, cheese from, from Cyprus. Cyprus. That's yeah. right. Did you hear that? <laughs> Cyprus. So, let's chop yes. some of... We could put this away for now. Yeah. Over there. And you could, you and I start taking these cucumbers yeah. and chop them. And we just, uh, you know, go like this. Wow. So you speak Arabic, you speak French? Yes, I do, because, you know, Lebanon was under the French occupation for a long time. So when, when I was in school in Lebanon, we had, you know, that's like, you know, 50 years ago. Uh, if you don't know French, then, then you cannot study mathematics. Oh, wow. You know, algebra, algebra, chemie, yeah. you know, all that is in French, not in Arabic in Lebanon. Yeah. I don't speak it as well anymore because living in the States yeah. for 45 years, I don't use it, but I, I can still get around I could understand it all right so right now we are gonna be chopping some tomatoes Pascal is doing that I'm chopping some scallions not a lot because we don't have a lot of cheese in there so we're just gonna do like two scallions and we did about four cucumbers and uh, Pascal is proud of her 
cherry tomatoes that she planted herself. Oh yeah, all from so her garden. From her, all from her garden. That's right. And I think we are good for tomatoes. We don't need yeah, any more. Yeah, okay. I get carried away, Pastor. You get a little carried away, I like me. Like me, I, I do get carried away too. <laughs> but you could, still, you could uh, save them for later. You know, it, it was so refreshing after a day's work, you know, after being locked in the house, seven o'clock in the evening, Pastor Raffle is on faithfully. Oh, you really? Faithfully, <laughs> wow. he's praying. Yeah. He doesn't care if one people turn up or 50 people turn up. Amen. He was faithfully on Facebook, on um, YouTube, over social media. He was there praying. Wow. That's awesome to know because, yeah, I felt led by the Spirit of God to do that right from day one when we heard about this, uh, you know, evil virus. Uh, I think it was March 13. And I started praying one hour every night, even when I got so sick and I was in a hospital. Even that did not stop me. I did lead prayer from the hospital room. I remember that poor nurse, she coming, and I think it's enough to come here. Yeah. We got carried away. And um, uh, we, um, yeah, I told the nurses, please leave the room right now. I need one hour to pray with my lovely people. What really makes the salad tasty is, is thyme. Now, this is fresh thyme from her garden. I've never used fresh thyme because I, I, I don't have fresh thyme. I don't, I never planted any. I don't know how to do that. But I used, I used uh, you know, a um, dry thyme. So we're just gonna pick him like this, you know. She probably knows how to do that more me, but I guess I, I figured out a way right now to do it. Yeah, okay, now we got the tomatoes, Now right? we're gonna pick it up a notch with a beautiful tomato from her garden. Yeah, guys, if you haven't watched Eden, my garden, tune in. Lovely tips in there. Look at this, look at this, is that beautiful? Look at that. You know, let me tell you something. You eat with your eyes if you know how to eat. <laughs> Before you eat with, you know, with your you know, mouth and tummy, you have you eat with your eyes. That means it has to look good. Yes, that's right. That's fantastic. Beautiful. Okay, now what's let's, next? Uh, let's baptize it. We have to baptize it with olive oil. <laughs> so we bring... Pastor Raffle, mm. while you're baptizing the the, the salad. The salad with the olive oil. I want you to sing a song in Arabic for oh me. Oh boy, no. Okay, now you're going like that and you're singing for me. For the audience. Audience, boy, would this, you like Pastor Raffle to this sing? Sister, yes. She knows how to put somebody on the spot. <laughs> okay, I want you to sing while you're baptizing. Okay, yeah. let's see, let's see. What can we sing? What will we do that? Hallelujah. Hada huwa al yawm, hada huwa al yawm, qad sana hurrab, qad sana hurrab. This is the day. This is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. This is the day that the Lord has And the olive oil, as you see, you have to be generous. So now, salt and pepper? Um, is it just salt? No, no, we don't need salt and pepper on That's this dish. That's it, yeah, we've I'm done? I'm just trying to think, oh, well, you know what would be very good? Is yeah. to add a little bit of sumac on top of this. Oh, let's yeah. get our sumac. Let's get some sumac and, and then it, we will be done. Look at how pretty this plate is. Voila. Voila, look at that. Ready to be eaten. Yes. Ladies first. Thank you. Oh, I want some cheese as well. Mmm. 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 Yummy. I'll tell you what, Pastor Rafu. This salad is like no other salad. Woo! Amen. You have to make this salad. It's delicious, it's healthy, it's simple. And you know what? I like it. Good, I'm I glad. I like it. Guys, keep tuning in, more coming. Have and God idea. bless you, thanks for watching. Thank you for our guest today. It's been such a pleasure cooking with you. Thank you, it's an honor. Yeah, we I had so much fun. I enjoyed myself. Yes, and now we're going to just sit down and rest and chill and eat. God bless you, see you soon. Amen.